25 laps of journey, round number eight for the American Racing Tire Services. Midget Series, time to smash the gas. Viney on the bottom side, leads over Whitaker, sweeping around the outside. Couldn't get the job done that time in a three and four, they are three and four wide. Singleton comes out side by side with Chaffee for third and fourth. Right on the bottom side, he's got Brown on the top side. Brown switches to the bottom, gets underneath right. Whittaker leads. Wind back in second. Singo getting put to the sword by Chaffee on the top side. Everybody running the gutter. Right goes to the top. Looking to go to the outside of Brock Dean. Rusty Whitaker. Doing it in fine style over Darren Dine at the moment. Charlie Brown finding the groove on the top. Goes to the high side of Singo. Chris Singleton has to relent the position. Rusty Whittaker, Darren Dine, Anthony Chaffee. Charlie Brown, Chris Singleton, Brock Dean, Glenn Rowe, Nathan Mathers. Matt O'Neill and Brad Dawson, the top ten. Oh, Charlie Brown just gave the wall a big smack out of turn four. Oh, Rusty. Won't him, mate. Won't bother him at all. Rusty Whitaker leads though. Brian come out to come under fire from Chaffee. Looking to close the gap now. Brock D now. Looking to put the fight to Charlie Brown as Tommy Klaus gets underneath Scotty Doyle. He continues to go backwards in this feature race. Meanwhile, Singleton under fire from Glenn Wright, who checks up as Singo cut the door, shut the door in his face. Nathan Mavis, Matty O'Neill, Brad Dawson, Klaus underneath Scott Doyle now. As Scotto brings the 96 into the crossover road and out of this feature, Whitaker though, driving off into the distance. In the 78 car, doing it for her tonight. As Vine sits in second spot, continues to hold that position from Chaffee. Brown has got away from Dean, who's got up to fifth at the moment. Hasn't been able to go any further. Chaffee gets it wrong as he throws it into three. Loses a bit of ground to Darren Vine. Singleton gets over the cushion. That allows right back up on the inside of the next gen 46. Brad Dawson trying to find a way past Mathers. Scotty Doyle, as I said, he was going backwards and has called it quits. Brings, brings the 80 car onto the infield. Singer gets the foot down and gets away from right once again. Meanwhile, our race leader in the traffic now gets past Cody Stoddard. Boy. Chaffee now, back in the uh, clutches of Charlie Brown. Brown looking for a way past the Wilson Landscaping Supplies, number 25. And he's bringing Brock Dean with him, the DTR Mechanical Services, number 99. Wright finally gets the job done on Singleton. The captain goes back in position. Matty O'Neill. Charlie Brown slide jobs Chaffee. Chaffee looks to come back on the inside. A beautiful pass from Charlie Brown. But Chaffee now looks to repay the favour. Three, one and two, but can't get it done. Brown now chasing up. Oh, oh somebody's stop around. Stoffard. That's Cody. Cody Stoffard around down in turn four. And that will bring the field up to Rusty Whitaker, who has got away from the chasing pack. Darren Vine under fire from Charlie Brown. What a slide job that was from Brown on Chaffee down in turn four. Trying to see who that uh, other car is back there. Oh, DJ Raw, And then uh, Stoddard at the tail of the field. 10 laps still left to run. Back to green we go. Round eight. 
from the ARTS series, series here at Archerfield Speedway. And Whitaker gets the jump on the field. Charlie Brown looking to put the sword through Darren Vine. Rock Dean's got Chaffee at the restart. He's taking Glen Road with him. In fact, Chaffee's gone back and it's three wide with Singleton and O'Neill through one and two. Yeah, right, he squeezed Chaffee up there on the back straight and Chaffee had nowhere to go, clipped the wall and went backwards. Rock Dean up the fourth. Chaffee going back through the field at the moment, obviously. Suffered a little bit of damage, clipping the wall. Oh, Whitaker! Gets into the cushion and squares the car up. Part the mouse stuff there. Here comes Brock Dean on Charlie Brown. This is for third. Dean on the bottom, Brown on the cushion. Brown gets the pace up there. Whitaker once again gets over the cushion in three. Darren Wright still sits second. A bit further back, Glenn Wright. The battle's on between O'Neill and Singleton in the 46. Bain is now having a look underneath Chaffee. There'll be five to run this time by. Bring us home, Macca. Down across the stripe goes winning it one more time. But the battle is between Charlie Brown and the DTR number 99 of Brock D. Three turns, one and two. Second, third and fourth within striking distance. Winning at the moment. Setting sail now for the checker. Oh, fighting goes in hard. Manages to keep it on four wheels. Darren Vine absolutely throwing caution to the wind. Him and Charlie Brown now breaking away from Brock Dean. Whitaker's got two laps to run this time by. Oh, Whitaker! Oh, Whitaker puts it on its side. He oh. got over the cushion, the car bounced, hit the wall, and is on its side. Wow, talk about throw it away inside of the checker. He, a couple of times there, Macquarie got in over that cushion and the car squared up a little bit, but that time it threw him into the fence. Rusty moving around in the car. Great shots by Alan Sollett. Climbs out. Round of applause, folks, for Rusty Whitaker. He'll be back to fight another day. And once again, Trevor, in our sport, you just never know, do you? No, you certainly don't. It uh, looked all in Rusty's hands to take the win, but unfortunately flirted with the cushion down here. One And Singo would be going, hang on a minute, that's P3 just in front of me. Absolutely. Don't write the captain off. Matty O'Neill having a great run in the Porsche Powered 16 as well. Time to mash the gas as we go racing with three laps to run. And Darren Vine, as he has so many times in his career, leads the way at Archfield Speedway. Charlie Brown can see the leader just in front. Brock Dean, what a battle he's had all season. Singo, Matt O'Neill, sticks the nose down underneath. Tries to up another spot, but Singo shuts the door in front of him. Spread out right across the racetrack. One lap left to run. Oh, Charlie Brown throwing everything he's got at it. A great three car battle splits them in the last corner. Oh, look out, it's on. Fine. Fine gets the win. Brock Dean, Charlie Brown over third. Chris Singleton, Nathan Mathers. Matt O'Neill, Glenn Wright, Anthony Chaffee, Brad Dawson, DJ Raw, and Cody Stothard. Oh my God! You wonder, Trev, why my voice sounds like this. Oh no, I know. It's just been one of those nights. How can you not get excited when you've got racing like that? Let's get the presentation done as, as quick as we possibly can, big fella. I'm not coming down to join you tonight. All right, buddy. Get him out of those cars, Chrissy Mack, if you can, as quick as you can, please. Viney parks the six up on victory lane. Rock D making his way out of the car. Charlie Brown as well. We get the guys out as quick as we can. As he climbs out of the six car, folks, put your hands together for Darren Vine.
in third place tonight. Put your hands together for Charlie Brown. Mate, top job. Jeez, uh, though, uh, at the end there, you're lucky to, uh, to hang on to it. You gave the wall a big hit out of four and unfortunately just let the other two back through. Yeah, nice slide job uh, earlier on, though. Yeah, we um, managed to salvage something out tonight. We sort of got John to be excited on that second heat and fell over on our side. But massive thanks to Brad, Kate, Kira, uh, Mum at home for watching the girls, Dad, just precision powder coating, um, next gen, HPS, IWS haulage, everyone that keeps this thing rolling. Mate, uh, great drive. Uh, unfortunately, third place, but uh, still on the podium. Yeah, I'll tell you what, I wish John prepped a track like that for us all the time. We can put on a show for the fans and uh, it makes good racing. Well done, buddy. Thank you. In second place tonight, he did it hard. Put your hands together for Brock Dean. Congratulations, buddy. Well done. Mate, uh, tough road into the feature tonight. Of course, you had to put a whole front end back in the 99, but you got it done. And, uh, well, old, uh, old head on shoulders uh, certainly paid off for you in the feature. Yeah, mate, just had to drive that one smart and be where the other guys weren't, basically. Um, managed to make that bottom work pretty nice, so that was pretty cool. Um, big thanks to all the guys off the 14 car for giving us a hand. Um, Chris Singleton dropped it in front of us, came and gave me a big hug and helped me put it all back together. So racing, that is racing, eh? Yeah, that's mateship uh, within the category and, uh, and Speedway fraternity as a whole, mate. But, uh, yeah, I've got to say, the last one and two on the last lap there, I thought you got it, uh, got, got them both, but unfortunately just couldn't get the drive. Yeah, that, that corner was the easiest one to get right. Um, that bottom corner there, she was real difficult. So I knew they'd have the run on the top. And then um, Charlie got in there and pulled a big slider. So it was a pretty cool finish. Congratulations, mate. Thanks, mate. Winner round eight of the American Tire and Racing Services Series at Archerfield Speedway. Put your hands together for Darren Vine. Congratulations, buddy. Well done. There's uh, two stickers for the tail tank. Mate, uh, tough job out there. Rusty, unfortunately, flirted with the cushion down in three once too often. Yeah, that's the luck of the draw, unfortunately, for Rusty. He's, he's definitely got some pace lately, and he runs the high line very well. And We were trying to keep with him, but he was just pulling away lap by lap. But um, unfortunately, come unstuck. And it, um, as the track was going on, the, the car was definitely getting unsettled up the top, and there was definitely a worry, and unfortunately, it bit him. But he definitely had the pace tonight. Mate, I've got to say, that last lap between you three was uh, unbelievable. <laughs> Yeah, I was actually waiting for it, so um, I knew uh, Charlie was there in second, and um, yeah, he made the dive for it, and um, yeah, I was just biding my time at the top, I, I couldn't hold on the bottom, so I had to just go up the top after the first couple laps, and um, yeah, Charlie did that slider, then I just turned it down and rolled, it, rolled off the throttle and got back past him, and yeah, it would have been a good, good last lap to watch. Congratulations, mate, well done. Thank you very much. Folks, put your hands together for our podium tonight in round eight of the American Tire and Racing Services. Archerfield Midget Series, Charlie Brown, Brock Dean, and the winner of round eight, Darren Vine. 30 laps of the journey, East Coast Logistics round number 13. Congratulations to our midget first, second, and third podium.